You know, if I've said it once, I've said it a thousand times. Phoenix flashlights have the best buttons in the business. Well, hey, everybody. How is your not Thursday going? Mine's going rather well. So, I'm excited because I have a new Phoenix flashlight. And Phoenix is undoubtedly one of my most favorite brands because of the craftsmanship and the quality in general. But, it's them buttons. So, this one I am very excited to show you and uh, since I've received it, I actually really love it. It's the Phoenix E20 version 2 AA battery flashlight. And the story behind me getting this was I was chatting with our friends at phoenixlighting.com. If you guys ever buy Phoenix stuff, buy it from them. They're great people and they've been nice to me. So I really appreciate that and I'm letting you guys know. We were talking about AA flashlights. I mentioned the E20. And they were awesome enough to send me one. And I am showing it to you today. Now, what makes this light really, really, really cool, aside from it's, you know, five inches long, uh, ergonomically, the way the body is set up, your hand just fits beautifully on it. And you've heard me say many times in the past that I am a fan of tail cap switches, just like my main light. I like to pull it out draw it, be able to turn it on, and not be turning the thing looking for the button. Well, this one, I gotta tell you, how this works, I was kind of leery when I had read about it, but now that I've used it, I want all my tail cap switch lights to work like this. And so how it goes, you don't just click on and then go for a side switch to go for your settings. You click on, and you just lightly press to increase your mode settings. And this goes up to 350 lumens, which is perfect for an EDC flashlight. So I'll tell you, it took me about, I don't know, 45 seconds to get used to it. And so far, putting it in the hands of others, they do the same thing. They go, oh wow, that's great. Not that I do not love my PD36R, but now it does seem a little awkward having to go for that side switch. I would love to be able to just pull this thing out and go whack, 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 and be at a higher setting. So that's why I'm super enthusiastic about that button. But the only thing, as I wish, Phoenix, please, make them tail cap standable. It wouldn't take much to raise that. Like the PD32, which I've had for years, a bunch of us actually have them. We love them because you can tail cap stand them. Not that I need all my flashlights to do that, but that's not a complaint about the flashlight. It's just my personal desires in preference so being an EDC flashlight something you can carry every day fortunately it has a low of five lumens and it's a very usable five lumens and you guys have also heard me say that that the longer I do this the more flashlights I own the more, importantly, I enjoy lower lumens. So, I appreciate the fact that it actually has a lower setting like 5, uh, as opposed to my other Phoenix lights, a lot of them start at 30, which is the next step on this, and it does a very good job. And being it's a AA cell, you're not going to, you know, chew up a crazy amount of battery life. Uh, even just the 5 lumens you get 200 hours so if you only ever use this in tight 
you know, small spaces, you're going to get a lot of runtime. The 30 lumens will go for 93 hours and 35 minutes. And then you have two more settings. You have your medium, which is 150. Uh, and being that this is a beautiful flood, it does quite a good job uh, with just that 150 lumens, which in reality is still quite bright. And that goes 11 hours, 15 minutes. Your high at 350 lumens will give you three hours and 45 minutes of runtime. And it actually is quite bright. I didn't notice any immediate step downs. The light never got hot, but at 350 lumens, uh, I wouldn't expect it to. And I have been running the same batteries in here for 10 days, and that's 10 days of using it a lot. We actually had the tropical storm blow through recently, and I was using this for hours while we had no electricity and going outside and you know, checking the weather conditions and stuff. So that's not bad. I mean, it's been a long time since I've ran a double A light as an EDC light. I used to change my batteries once a month. It's the usual Phoenix quality standards. It's IP68, dust proof, waterproof, it's drop proof. Uh, these lenses have some type of fancy automobile coating on them. Um, but that's another thing that I love about Phoenix. I love that copper, copper bezel. It's just a beautiful looking flashlight, as pretty much most all Phoenixes are. The belt clip, nice and tight. It's not a dual way clip, but it's a five inch flashlight, so not exactly necessary but again ergonomically the way that body is your hand just fits perfect boom 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 in the house near the door on the countertop you can imagine in this house we have a bunch of flashlights and i can tell you every single time that it was needed jen grabbed this flashlight and I said, wow, you've been using that a lot. And you know what she said? She said, yeah, I love that. Easy, bam, get right to what you need. So, I just thought I'd share those thoughts with you on that. So everybody, thank you for checking this out. And again, my thanks to Phoenix Lighting. I want you, the viewers, to know that they're great people out there. They're out in Colorado, just like a lot of our other friends out at Shack West. And they're great to deal with. I, if and when I buy Phoenix stuff, I don't get everything sent to me. I've spent hundreds of dollars there in just the past year, and I'm glad to do so because they're good people. And I appreciate them, as well as you, for watching. So I'm going to leave the link to their website down below. So if you guys want to check this out, it's very fairly priced and it's just awesome. I'm telling you, you get one of these in your hand, you're gonna say, oh, I wish my light did that. That's the truth. See you guys all next time. Until then, enjoy your not Thursday. <laughs>